for the Beaver Radio Network. I'm Brian Schultz. PSU men's hockey team opens up the playoffs at Ferris State this weekend. Joined by Marcus Gerbrandt, scored last weekend at uh, Bowling Green. Congratulations. Thank you. You uh, seem to be a guy that scores in bunches when you do score. Uh, that's a good thing. Uh, how can you sustain that uh, throughout this weekend as well? I guess we got to just uh, – our line's been going fairly well right now. We got a few points last weekend. I guess we just got to carry that on to Ferris because – Right now, these are, the, these are the most important games, so we've got to keep it going. Do you feel like it's, as the cliche goes, a new season? Yeah, it is. It's a clean slate. It's Everyone's 0-0 zero and zero right now, so I guess uh, any team can win right now, and it's, it's going to be the more determined team that uh, comes out on top. So, You personally have had some success over Ferris. Uh, I think you've scored in three out of the four games this year against them. Uh, the team has played well as a whole uh, against them. How much confidence does that give you and the rest of the team? Yeah, no. Uh, when when you're uh, successful against the team, it's it's good. I mean, it's good for the confidence. And uh, <clears throat> right now, you want to have you want to have high confidence in your game. You want to be able to to make plays, and uh, that's what we're gonna have to do to beat them. How, for lack of a better term, was stinging uh, was last weekend's results of. I mean, he didn't play bad, but you still get nothing nothing to show for it. Yeah, no, it was it was definitely frustrating. But uh, the bottom line is, it's playoffs now. It's a it's a new season. It's a new team, and we got to start going right now. As a team, what do you think you guys did the best uh, throughout the course of the season? Uh, we had some ups and downs for sure, but I think we've been learning every game. I think we've we've obviously had some took some games off, obviously, but I mean we've got better every game throughout the season. I think right now we just got to keep it simple and do what we do best and just kind of go forward from there. You're not that terribly old, but uh, you're one of the, the more veteran guys uh, on this team. you got a lot of young guys on this uh, roster. How do you think they've come along throughout the course of the year? They've been good. I mean, <clears throat> obviously with nine, nine young guys, new guys on the team, I think they've all uh, grown into their spots and they we all know our roles by now, so right now we just gotta gotta go into it and and just do what we do. What in particular do you and and Corey and uh, Harmsey do well? I think we kind of we try and keep it simple. We obviously we want to generate as much offense as we can, but we want to be uh, the one the one thing we've emphasized is just being good defensively too. It, it starts a good offense starts in the in the D zone, and right now we're trying to not get scored against, but yet still get goals for so. Uh, special teams this time of year are so important. Uh, your power play had a hiccup or two last weekend. Uh, couldn't score on the two five on threes you had on Saturday, but you were getting chances. How difficult is it to not get too frustrated by not getting a goal? Yeah, it is. It's frustrating. I mean, we're getting a ton of shots, but right now nothing's going in for us. But I mean, if we if we keep working hard, it will come. And uh, right now, like I said, it's a it's a new season. It's we're zero for zero on the power play and playoffs. So hopefully we can start from there and just build on it. On the flip side, uh, what have you noticed about your penalty kill? That uh, I mean, they've been so good all year uh, that, that they weren't necessarily last weekend. Yeah, we kind of they, well, they've been they've been real good this whole year. We kind of had a hiccup this past weekend, but you kind of just got to forget about. It. I think the main thing is just the small things, the details. We got to when you get a chance to clear a puck, you got to clear it. And they're block they what they've done so well this year is block shots. We got to got to focus on that. And when we do block a shot, just it's got to be down the ice immediately. Everything happens really fast in this rink. Same thing uh, really at Bowling Green last weekend. How much did, do you think that prepares you for what's in store for you this weekend? Yeah, no, it was pretty similar rink there in Bowling Green, real small. Basically, the, the game plan is just to keep it simple. I mean, it's got to be quick plays. There's basically no corners. So whenever you get the puck, you got to make a quick play, take it to the net, and just capitalize on, on loose pucks. Best of luck. Thank you.